Hello everyone, myself Lavanya, Assistant Professor from CSIT Department in MLR Institute of Technology and Science. Today we will discuss HTML, text formatting, tags and uh, image tags also. Right? And uh, these are the list of text formatting tags. These are the list of text formatting tags. Those are bold and big, emphasize. I, Italic, Small, Strong, Sub, Superscript, Subscript and Superscript, INS, Inserted Text and Deleted Text. If you want to insert the whatever the content you have to insert in the web page, that will be displayed in the form of bold by using bold tag. And big tag, whatever the information you want to insert, that text will be defined in the form of big MLR IT like this. Right? And by using emphasize tag, it will print in the form of italic only, italic only. And by using I also, it will display the in the form of italic. By using small text formatting tags, it will display like this, small. And strong, it is same like bold also. Right? The same like bold, it displays content in the bold format. And subscript, subscript means it display in the form of x2 like this, h2o, x2 like this. And by using super keyword, superscript keyword, the content, whatever the content you have to insert in between the superscript keyword, that will be displayed in the form of x square. And ins, it means it will display the inserted text. And what about delete tag, right? Del tag means it will be, it will display the content whatever the content stored in between del tag that will be displayed but mark text but it will mark the text h2 for example within the del i need to use del h2 and del h is my content right it will display like h it will be display with the marking text right these are the text formatting tags and now we will discuss how will how it will print right bold and strong as the same right both tags are used to make text bold right whatever the content if you want to insert some bold text in your web page then you have to use bold tag and also strong tag right the text content of the tag is shown as the highest important whatever the text you have to write in between the bold and in between the strong that will be more important information in the web page right whatever the information you uh, you want to share to the user it's a important text that will be keep it in bold tag or else strong tag right this is the html tag and head tag with we know already uh, with whatever the text in between title tag that will be inserted as a title of web page and next within the body whatever the content you have to write it in the body that will be displayed to the user right here within the bold i am using bold text within the b tags i am using bold text right that will be display bold text and whatever within the strong tag i am using strong text same similar to bold right like this it will be it will display and next is the italic italic and emphasize for italic if you want to insert any italic content in the web page it will use you, you can use i i tag italic tag and also emphasize tag both are used to make the text italic and emphasized right and uh, both element opening and closing tags also those both are having opening tag and closing tag right and this is the syntax for italic and also emphasize here in between the italic tag i'm using the text inside italic i'm writing the text inside italic this content is displayed in the form of italic right and whatever emphasize text I'm writing in between the emphasize tag and then it will be displayed like this, right? And these few more text formatting tags are strong, small, highlight. And whatever the content you had to write in between the strong tag, it will display the strong like bold. And whatever the content you had to write, hello MLRAT, that will print 
as a small content right and whatever the content you had to write in between the mark tags that content this hello mlrt content as a mark if you want to highlight any information in your web page then you can use mark tag right this uh, and few more text formatting tags are there those are subscript and superscript right if you want to insert any content in the web page in the form of x square superscript format right then you have to use sup tag then you have to use sup tag here i am using hello is in paragraph then sup mlrit is in the form of sup i want to print mlrit in the form of superscript right for that i am using hello it will print hello right and superscript tag whatever the content in between the superscript tag sup tag then it will display as a superscript mlrit x square hello upper mlrit and subscript here paragraph is hello is printed hello is printed and then subscript for hello it will the sub mlrit is print like this this is the subscript and this is the superscript this two are also text formatting tags right and then deleting right del is also there in text formatting tags del for using that delete we need to use del tag del is a keyword in between del we are using um whatever the tag you have to write in between the del that will be display as a marking right display as a marking strike through the text marking the past part as deleted it has on opening and closing tag del element is used to strike like this hello mlrt is strike up strike through the text marking the part as deleted it also has opening and closing tags right here my title is delete my web page is title is delete right and uh, whatever the text i am writing in between the delete in between the delete tag it will display as a del lavanya right close del then this lavanya content is uh, display as a strike right this is also the text formatting tags right and next as the image tag if you want to insert any image in the web page you can use image tag by using the image tag you can insert the image in the web page right in html images are defined with the image tag this is the tag we are using for inserting image right the image tag is empty if the image tag is empty it contains attributes only it contains attributes only and does not have a closing tag for image there is no closing tag how to close the tag by using forward slash right by using forward slash we can close the tag right for image there is no closing tag and the source attribute specify the url of the image right if you want to insert mlrt image or else parrot image right you have to copy the image path you have to copy the image path and paste here right source you have to give the source of the image right into the web page for the web page you have to give the source of the image image source equals to path and alternative some text right this alternative text if the image cannot be displayed right if this alternative text for an image this alternating attribute specifies the alternating text of for any image right if image is not display in the web page then this text is appear right this all this is about the image tag and you can add the some properties or some attributes to image tag also for example i want to display the image some space only right some measurements with some measurements only so for that you can add the width and height also right you can use width and height attributes also here the values are specified in pixels only right by default the image is specified in the pixels only 
right and this is the example image source equals to this is my source right if it is in the same folder right if it is same folder then you have to give image name that's it dot jpg right and this is my alternating text if this image is not appear then this text will be appear right and here i am giving some properties right height and width if the image is in another folder if the Im if your image is in another folder then give the link or the path of that image by using source right image source equals to give the path and alternating text and then height and width right and if you want to insert image as a link by clicking on the image the required for website is open right for that to use image as a link simplify nest the image tag inside a anchor tag right if you are if you want to insert the image as a link in your web page then you have to use anchor tag right this is the example anchor href equals to this is my reference website path right and this is the image image path and alternative and height and width right uh, what is the syntax of image image src equals to path and alternative text right if you want to give the properties then you can add height and width right this is the basic program for image for inserting the image html body html image example right image source equals to good morning dot jpg so it is in the same folder only that's why image name dot jpg and alternative text is good morning friends right close the body and close the html right like this we need to insert the image right now we'll see how will we, how it will execute right now we'll execute the program of image and bolt also so i need the program for displaying the bold and italic right for that i need to copy this right open the notepad within the notepad paste here right first uh, tag is html tag then body and title is bold and strong right head and open the body what is our uh, main aim you have to print the content in the bold you have to print and content in the bold for that we need to use bold tag right whatever the information you want to print that will be added in the form, in the paragraph tag right here paragraph tag is there and bold i want to display the content in the bold format i am writing here as lavanya and the strong text i want to print the text in the form of how it will be display right how it will display by using bold and tag bold bold and strong right within the body only paragraph my paragraph i want to display this paragraph text in the form of bold and i want to display this paragraph this paragraph text in the form of strong right for that save already know right already we knows one dot one two dot html program name dot html my program name is one two and save it in anywhere in your system i am saving in desktop save it in desktop and open that it will save like this only open this and this content is like this lavanya and lavanya same both are same if i want to print the text in the form of italic right for that i'm adding itself only i as my italic tag if you want to print any text in the form of italic then the tag is i only close the i right save 
and opened. Right? First lavanya is this lavanya is displayed in the form of italic. What about underline? You have to use U given. Right? For superscript, you are using lavanya. Right? This is my information. And I want to print the prasad as a superscript or subscript. Right? So, for that, SUP is my keyword. Okay, SUP is my tag. Right? And then close SUP. Right? Close SUP. Close paragraph. Save it is save and open. Right? See here, superscript is applicable to this content, Lavanya Prasad. Right? And now we'll discuss uh, we'll excuse the image program. Right? Whatever the program is here. For image for image, if you want to insert any image, you have to use image tag, right? And now Open notepad. After opening the notepad, you have to write the program. Here HTML is there. Body. Head is HTML image example heading. And here image source is good morning JPG. It is not save in the system. So I need to use this copy, this path. Right? This is one image is there. Right? I need to use this image. So you have to save this image path here s save and after that open that page and good morning friends is my for example i want to insert any birds right save image address and save it here So no need. Here I'm using this double quotes it's two times. So now it will display the image. Right? Here the image is open. Right? I'm giving the image path. And next one is the if you have to give the image as a link. Right? One more is there, right? So for that we need to use we can to give the yes here I need to save clear head is image tag and here paragraph clicking on the image to know about your robotics by clicking on the image it will open the robotics page right and uh, this is the link right this is the link which so, which uh, website you want to visit, you want to insert, right? This is the link. And next, and you have to give the image source also, right? This is my image source. This is my image source. I want to give the parrot image. For example, PGN image is there, right? So, I have to give the PGN image. So, go to Google, copy image address. Then you have to give here. Okay, and save on a desktop one, two, three dot HTML. Desktop. Right? Save and by opening this, see how it will execute. Right? The pigeon is open by clicking on this pigeon. The robotic site is open, right? Like this, we need to create image as a link. And uh, today we covered all these text formatting tags and image tags. In tomorrow's class, we'll discuss tables, list, and the few more tags are there. Those all are discussed in the next class. Thank you.